As you begin building your forms library, you have two options. You can either get a head start by using our templated forms, or if you have forms in the practice that you already like, you can upload your own. So let's get started. First, you'll visit the Forms tab. Then, select Forms and Packets. This will give you a view of all of the forms already available in your account. From here, we'll select Customize Forms to add new ones. This will take you into your Forms engine, where you'll be able to view all of the forms you currently have in the account, as well as any packets you've already configured. To have a new form converted from one of yours in the office into a digital form, you'll select Convert Form. This will take you to a page where you can submit those forms to be converted by a member of our team. The team will digitize it for you within about 72 hours and notify you as soon as it's available for use. Alternately, if you'd like to get a head start and have forms added immediately, you have the option using Build Form. This will take you into your form builder. To get a head start, you're going to select Template and choose from one of our 45 templates pre-built for you. Let's say today we're going to add a HIPAA form. This will populate everything you need for this form already. You can make changes to these sections using the gray gear icon beside the text. This will open an editor where you can then change the language. When you're done, click Save. If there are any fields in this form you'd like to remove, you can do so using the red X button. After you've customized this form and it looks the way you'd like, you can then choose Save and View. This will show you the form from the patient perspective, so you can get a preview of exactly what your patients are going to experience. When you're ready, you'll click Done from the lower right-hand corner. Now you can begin adding your new forms into packets. Packets are used as shortcuts to help you get that information over to your patients faster without having to remember exactly which forms to send each time. One of the most common packets is a new patient packet. To begin, you'll create packet and then create the internal name. Then select the forms you'd like to upload from your list. When you're finished, click Create. Now, when you return to your Next Health account and refresh the page, you'll be able to see all of the forms you've just created in addition to the packets that you've added. You are now ready to start sending forms and get patient information digitally.